So scoring a lot of points, that's nothing new. But what is new is our commitment to defense this year. We're making a huge commitment to defense and rebounding. So uh, we would rather win some games. If we score 118, we don't want the other team to score 119. Rigby explains the efforts being made in practice to push a team known for its offensive production toward this new defensive attitude. Um, at practice right now, we're working our main drill is a thing called stop, score, stop. In other words, whereas we used to just strive for points, 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 we start in the half court and we have to get a stop on defense, we have to score on that possession on offense, and then get another stop to get a point in practice. So everything is negated at practice right now unless we, uh, unless we have a score in between two stops on defense, and that's putting an emphasis on the defense that we need. After finishing third in the Sunbelt Conference last season, Coach Rigby's Trojans are predicted to finish fifth this season. But Rigby says that this ranking is simply a testament to the strength of the competition. I look at it one way. It shows you how good our conference is, that we could get we get picked fifth after returning so many good players and finishing third, and we got bumped down to fifth. Um, so it does show how good our conference is, but, but it also, I mean, it, it, it is fodder for motivation. Um, in no way, shape, or form do we see ourselves as fifth, but we have to prove it. We have to prove it every day and in every game. So. Um, we won't be happy at all unless we finish first, and that's what we're striving for every day. Now that the season is here, one senior shares examples of defensive strategies that could ultimately define the team. Boxing out and rebounding are the two main things that we've been working on at um, practice, and I feel like if we get those two down, then we'll be unstoppable. Ryan Renfro, Troy, Trojan Vision Sports.